dedication we have to our employees and the quality of our shoes. Eris Running Shoes. Always running from something. Buying a gift for the guy that has everything? Log on to PetsOvernight.com. We've got exotic pets galore, including tigers, cobras, manatees, and white rhinos. All delivered overnight. PetsOvernight.com. Delivering little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. All right, now joining us in the studio, we have a very special guest. His new book, Karate and Digestion, has been on the top 100 self-help books for the past three weeks. He is the founder of Now and Zen Dojo and Organic Food Market in Trenton. His name is Reed Tucker. Welcome to Chatterbox, Reed. Why, thank you, Badlo. It certainly is an honor to be here. Me and the fellas need to talk business, so you're going to look after my girl for the evening. Hey, Maria, move your butt. Dumb broad does this every time. And here she is, the one and only Queen of Sheba. What were you doing up there? Whatever it was, I bet it cost me money. Well, you don't think I hang around here for the conversation, do you? Get in the car and keep your big mouth shut. Take the limo, but bring it back in one piece, you hear me? And watch her. She can be trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure your new lapdog has everything covered. And isn't he big and strong? Hey, fighter, let's go visit Chico and get some party treats. He's at the rail station at the Chinatown waterfront, I think. I could chop a bus in half. Sometimes. No offense, but you're kind of a scrawny, pasty dude. And it says on the inside cover of your book that you still live in your parents' basement. Okay, it, it's not a basement. I prefer a center for spiritual enlightenment. In chapter 17 of my book, which I know you've read, I address the dangers of cynicism. That low, closed mind is like a closed fist, and karate means open hand. That might as well mean open mind. If you like wheatgrass, I think you'll really like it. Well, I'm not a masticating cow, so I really don't enjoy chewing damp hay and prancing around in leggings, shouting, I go! Okay, that though, I'm warning you this time. Do not make me angry. It's bad for my karma. It will definitely be bad for your karma. I suspect the martial arts are the stand of bullies just like you, and I encourage everyone listening out there on Chatterbox to buy my book and learn how organic food and martial arts can help you too. <laughs> And I encourage anyone who needs a doorstop or a booster seat to buy it as well. Let's see who's on the phone. I'm Mirai, my favorite lady. You looking for some fun? A little from Spain? Hey, Chico. Nah, just the usual read. There you go, lady. Hey, maybe you should check out the warehouse party at the East End of Atlanta Keys. Thanks, Chico. See you around. Gracias. And enjoy. I could stop. Let her out of my life. I scooted around the house with my legs. Come on, Fido, let's go and check out this place now. But my husband says I look like a chicken the exorcist. I even saw the dairy on the top shelf of the fridge so I couldn't reach it with my legs from behind my head and all. But I really need to stop popping the shelf through. What can I do, Reed? Do not fret. Hey, get your Shut up, you carnivore. Why don't you go gnaw on a bone like a gorilla bad, though? Our ancestors didn't eat chicken wings. We were for orange and in their ecosystem. Subsisting on a diet of nuts, berries, and leafy vegetables. Yes, and they threw stones at their own shadow and died of old age and fear at 24. Bad, though, the soul is eternal. But let me answer the question. When I'm in trouble or tempted by the all-you-can-eat breakfast buffet with a huge pan of juicy bacon... Can we get some bacon in here? Bad, though, I go back to bacon. I start the day with a foodie beverage, some meditation, and six hours of yoga. Next, I go open up my shop, now and then, and drink two pints of hand-pressed tea. And who wants a steak after that? Okay, next caller, you are on Chatterbox with Reed Tucker. Yo, Reed, come to the music, dope. How can I learn to beat up ten guys at once? Okay, first things first, my man. You need to stop the negative thinking. And the best attack I've found is to just... All right, away. Hunter, you wait that here and look after here. this car while I go with you. What, right? Raptors. Like a bat. I don't want to hear about no tofu running away. I want to learn about being a ninja. People's ass. Actually, I do cover this early on in the book in... Soy and origami. Concentration begins in the mind and spreads to all the extremities of the body. You must use the language of the body, not the tongue. And the language of the body begins with raw, uncooked, organic vegetables. 
just a me. I could tear a phone book in half with my bare toes. In fact, Ladlow, I could easily chop this desk in two half desks. Now this desk is made of... Four or five to all units. This is narcotic grade of NFT. Well, I'm near finish. There's three drawers and knowing this station, it cost $100. In his own words, Reed Tucker is about to smash it into two half desks. Take it away, Reed. And now I shall make it. Hey, oh, oh, my hand in my. I think he's all bent the wrong way. Listen, Karate Kid, the death gets still in one piece. Thanks for coming on the show. Okay, lad, though, mockery will get you nowhere. I think I'm gonna hit you now. Oh, I bruised easily. Don't throw any tofu or bean curds at me. Okay, very funny, lad. You didn't make fun of me, but it's all the fault of the funk sway in here. Downright disgraceful. Lad, you make me talk like this. Okay, the listener lines are open. This is Chatterbox. You're on the air. Hey, Ledlo. That last guy was a lunatic. Where'd you take him up from? The state movie bin? That wacko you had going on about killer bees? What a moron. I mean, just read a newspaper. Killer bees. Uh, they pulled some artificial sweeteners and soda pop. Oh, well, it's all part of the government's propaganda plan. I might as well wear a satellite and turn propaganda right into my brain. Come on, do you honestly believe NSA's echelon system is already reading your emails and recording your phone conversations? It's all designed to frighten us to complain about a right to be whatever boogeyman they come up with today. Uh, well, I mean, you realize that the government listens to this station, and, and if they weren't paying particular attention to you before, they're probably going to be following you now. Oh, yeah. Look, they already got me once. You know, I enjoyed myself for the first time in a long while, and you, you know, you treated me really good with respect and everything. Well, I better go. <laughs> I'll see you around, I hope. Soccer is soccer's for little girls, man. Football.